Hey, Paula. Meet me at the partner. Uh, I was born um, in Albany, Georgia. Mm -hmm. Home of Field Mob, uh, Ray Charles, um, shit, Jimmy Carter. Uh, yeah, I, I grew up on a, on a farm from like what one to age seven, then moved to Decatur. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know what I'm saying? I, um, the city life, um, I actually, it, it actually kind of changed me and shit because I, coming from where I'm coming from off a of dirt road and shit like that, when you watching TV, looking at Michael Jackson or uh, Bill Bill DeVoe, Bobby Brown, and all these, these uh, prominent folks, and whatnot, you want to be on TV, but you don't know how to get there from the country. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, when I came to a Atlanta and everything, uh, it, it just really opened my mind up and it just made me see nothing but opportunity. And I didn't know how I was going to do it, I, um, but I knew I wanted to uh, to be an uh, entertainer. Uh, my mama, she went with that shit. <laughs> I, I had one eye, and so yeah. she didn't see, foresee me being talented enough to, uh, you know what I'm saying, supersede what society thought a star was. So she wanted me to be an eye doctor so I could uh, help my eye. <laughs> she wanted you to be an eye doctor? Yeah, she wanted me to be an eye doctor. <laughs> Black mamas. Black mamas. Yeah. <laughs> wanted you to be practical and shit. Because the whole thing was she didn't want to take care of me. She didn't want to take care of me or uh, wanted me to be able to take care of myself when I got older mm -hmm. and blah, blah, blah. So just wanted to make sure that I did something that made sense. Um, you know, I went to uh, Miller Grove. Uh, uh, Rita Ann High School went in in '96, came out in '96. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, what happened, dog? What happened, bro? I was fighting every day of school. Kids was always, you know, what I'm saying, picking on me because of my eye and shit. And I was never one to uh, uh, turn down a fight. If you want to, if you want to smoke, you could get it with me. Yeah. You know, win, lose, or draw. I would fight like four, five kids at a time. And you know, Atlanta, one of them places, man, it's so easy to get into uh, trouble. Yes. And it's so hard yes. to get out. Yes. And uh, you know what I'm saying? I stayed in that shit till, you know, my mama just got sick of that shit and she just came up to read in. And you know, the uh, principal, uh, Mr. McGrady, uh, he told uh, told my mama, I think it'd be best if you just go ahead and take him on out. Cause I had been in uh, 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 special ed the whole time I was in school. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I got straight A's cause you know. It, <laughs> <laughs> and we didn't have to do nothing but color. Yeah, yeah, we yeah. were just coloring. That's all we was doing. I was one of the best coloring motherfuckers you'll ever meet in your life. Knew how to stay in the lines. Um, yeah. So when um I had got out of uh, school, I ain't know what to, I ain't know what to do. I would be listening to the radio every morning, and uh, I would be listening to uh, the uh, Ryan Cameron Morning Show, mm -hmm. and like he kind of was a soundtrack to my life. And uh, I used to do this, like, little gay character named Honey Bun. I would call in there just fucking around because mm -hmm. I ain't had nothing to do. Mm -hmm. And he would invite me up to uh, Hot 97 to um, uh, uh, do the, the morning show with him. And then when he was like, oh, man, I thought you was a gay dude. No, nah, I, mean, I was just fucking around. Uh, he was like, you should be a, a comedian and shit. But it, it looked harder than it really is when, they, when you see it on TV and shit. Mm -hmm. You know, them niggas be funny. For about 30 minutes and like long periods of time. And when you in class and you being funny, it's in spurts. Yes. You know what I'm saying? You make your little outbursts, everybody busts out laughing, then somebody else do some shit and blah blah mm -hmm. blah. So it just a little bit look a little bit more difficult than it really is.